Our chancellor created a sexual assault task force to address what has become a huge issue that we're becoming more and more knowledgeable about, which is campus sexual assault. And that task force was a really powerful experience for me. It was a new uh, faculty member at KU, and we applied for a large federal grant um, through HHS. And they uh, were looking to work with multiple campus partners um, to really focus on both prevention and policy related to campus sexual assault. And these three women, um, myself included, um, really came together in this nice interdisciplinary way. We come at this issue from, I think, complementary but diverse perspectives. And I think that that team has been really exciting. This is the first year of that we received this grant, and so we work with eight campus partners two historically black universities, two faith-based uh, universities, large um, public universities, some small private universities, a commuter college. And we really have this opportunity to see how the approach that we're using, which is a public health, gender-centered, strength-based approach um, to working with campuses around prevention and, and policies related to addressing sexual assault on campus. We have this opportunity of both helping to really shape their uh, institutional level change and also collect a lot of data that can help to inform how they're developing their prevention and, and policy initiatives. We've just piloted um, campus sexual assault surveys and we'll be doing that with our campus partners and so we'll be able to both share that back with universities and also be able to look at that information in the aggregate level and be able to help inform the field.